A short one today, but a good one nonetheless. Uh, a few years ago I uploaded some screenshots of a game called Metal Slug 6 to a site called Moby Games. If you're not aware of either of them, Metal Slug 6 is an arcade shooter, uh, side-scrolling, some of the best artwork, in fact possibly the best artwork in um, video games. Uh, it's ridiculously high quality pixel art in that game, or in the whole series, in fact. Um, and Moby Games is a video game database, user contributed and um, crowdsourced and all that stuff. And there were no screenshots for that game, or high quality ones anyway, so I took it by myself to upload a few. After spending ages wrangling an emulator to get it to go, to, to run because it's a bit of an awkward one to get going. Anyway, I managed it and uh, got some decent screenshots up on Moby Games. Not long after that, a fella uh, whose name escapes me at the moment wrote to me. I don't know how he managed to get hold of my email. Must have been uh, must have been off Moby Games. Maybe you can send an email through that. I don't know. But nevertheless, he wrote to me and said, hey, how on earth did you take a screenshots of Metal Slug 6? Because I can't work out how to do it. And so I explained my method and how I got it to work and how I'd got quality screenshots of the game. So I said thank you. And then um, that was that. Anyway, it turns out the fella wrote for Bitmap Books. So um, the people behind the SNES Visual Compendium. I've got it behind me, I should know. Uh, various books on video game cover art and artwork within the video games as well. Fantastic coffee table reads. And once again, some of the greatest uh, artwork you've ever seen. I have one of their books, the, Advent the Point and Click Adventure Game book. Again, I can't remember the name exactly, but it's full of just wonderful pictures of classic point and clicks. Pixel art, the lot, you name it. And some fantastic interviews as well with, with people who created these games. Anyway, you probably see what I'm getting at here. This is one of their books. Metal Slug. Metal Slug? It doesn't... Uh, the title is on the right. The Metal Slug Ultimate History. There you go. <laughs> and, well, um, predictably enough, it's got artwork and pixel art and uh, interviews and various other bits of history of the game. But I was very happy to see in the very back of the book, I don't know if you'll be able to see it, it's very heavy, but just uh, just underneath my... hang on. Just underneath my little finger, that's me! It's me! I'm in a book! So there we go. That's my little uh, claim to fame there, one of many. Um, I've got lots of claims to fame, but no actual fame. There you go. Uh, so, that's that. I'm just seeing what the other... The SNES? Yeah, Visual Compendium, I was right. Ha ha ha. Yeah, have a look for bitmap books, they do some brilliant stuff. Anyway, that's that. So thank you for watching, I'll see you all tomorrow. See, if I'd edited this properly, I could have done the Metal Slug ending to the, to the level that says... Uh, Mission complete! But I ain't done that. Just recorded it quickly. Anyway, bye!